Hey guys, what's up? Lord Meacher again here, your lord of video games, and welcome to another episode of Persona 5 Royal. In the last episode, we actually got a lot done. So we advanced, I believe it was just a full day? No, it, yeah, it was just a full day, and we're now on that second day. But we did so much on that first day, like, you have no idea. We actually spent also time with Takemi, and we found, well, not found, but we explored a little bit of a new underground labyrinth, if so. It's going to be a dungeon, but it's a dungeon you can visit a lot, which I believe is where we will find our side quest. So we found our side quest dungeon. Anyway, with our day completed, we're just going to end it by watching a little bit of MacGyver or Guy MacVer. So, yeah, it's not MacGyver. Get it right. There's sulfur leaking from the tank. We need to do something fast. It's fine. I'll just use this chocolate. See, the acid and the sugar are reacting. <laughs> it's a story about a man who never gives up, beating all odds with science and science and ingenuity. Wow. He fixed the tank's crank with chocolate. How does he stay so calm at a time like that? Yeah, MacGyver. Hey, hey. A protagonist knew just what to do despite the crazy situation. Maybe you learn a thing or two about proficiency from watching this drama. Hmm. Good, because we kind of need a proficiency. A proficiency is kind of low. It's the only stat that we still have rank one. So well, soon we're going to rank it up, hopefully. Well, it's starting to get late. Let's head to bed soon, okay? All right. Let's, uh, let's advance the day. 6.4, 6.3. Sell on that. Oh. Mishima? Hey, I saw on the forum. Nice job sticking it to that stalker. My Phantom Aficionado website came in handy, didn't it? What are you talking about? It's okay. You don't have to say it. I know deep down in my heart that it was useful. Anyway, I'm in Shibuya right now. I'd love if you could come hear me out about your future actions. I'll be waiting at the diner in Shibuya. You gotta swing by. What is he up to? That's a good question, Morgana. Well, let's go meet him. Might as well. Have things been? You know, with the special activities. <sighs> Why are you tired? You okay? Oops. <laughs> Sorry about that. I uh, haven't been getting a lot of sleep lately. Why? I've been staying up managing the fan site all night. Every night. I think it's called PR. Mishima. I don't understand. <laughs> you want to know more? Maybe. Basically, there's no point to taking down bad guys if nobody's going to know about it. I mean, you're right. That's why I've started a blog for posts from people you guys saved, while filtering out the haters. Mm, good job. We need the Phantom Thieves to be seen in the proper light if we want to make the name popular, right? Mm-hmm. Well, hmm. Sounds pretty tough. Is this really necessary? Uh, sounds pretty tough. You're not wrong, but it's nothing compared yeah. to what you guys do. I'm just supporting from the shadows. Is this a confidant thing that I just got? Oh no, I'm not choosing correctly then. Oh, so no. actually, I really want to know how you punish people. Um, that's a little bit uh, kinky, Mishima. I think we should uh, not be talking about this in public. Uh, you know. Uh, Don't worry, I'm not gonna ask. It wouldn't be any fun if you just up and told me. Hmm. After all, the Phantom Thieves have a reputation for being secretive. You really are. <laughs> oh my god. I... I wish I could be more like you guys somehow. But say that? I'll still be here to draw attention to the stuff you do. You can leave that part to me. 
I'm gonna use my fan site to promote the Phantom Thieves and weed out any negative comments. Well, thank you. Your popularity is gonna be at my mercy. Uh. Or, uh, at my fingertips. Um. It's like I'll be your strategic image management representative, so to speak. Thank you. You're really hyped for this. <laughs> hey! Just you wait. I'm gonna do everything I can to make sure that title's more than just for show. <sighs> What's wrong, my boy? <sighs> I've gotta say, though, managing the Phantom Thieves' reputation is tiring work. You need to get some sleep, my man. The forum gets all sorts of weird posts, including tons of things unrelated to reforming society. Like what? It'd defeat the purpose of the site if the truth of the Phantom Thieves was buried among all that garbage. Uh. Oh, but you don't need to worry. I'll sort through all the trash. But get sleep too. Speaking of which, I've actually already found some worthwhile info about our very own school. Oh? Our quest to boost your popularity can start close to home. Okay. I'll give him my all. Thank you. <laughs> Mishima seems motivated. <sighs> we ranked it up, even though we screwed up a lot. All right. Then Confidant has increased the rank too. All right. Mishima will now give you information on targets and mementos. Oh, I, I think I skipped it. I didn't see what he gave me. I'm stupid. After making a target, have a change of heart. Meet with Mishima to deepen the trust between you. Uh oh, he'll give you more information on new targets. Okay. I might be overworking myself, though. Yeah, rest uh, up, man. Uh, you need to rest. Rest is also very important. Man, I'm exhausted. I think I'd fall asleep on the spot if I weren't talking to you. Then go home and I rest. Head home. Yes. See you later. See you, Mishima. Thank you, though. But please, sleep. <laughs> oh, there he is. Oh, Miyake? Listen to this. I was checking the fan site earlier and found a bunch of hater comments about the Phantom Thieves. It got me so mad. I'm not even sleepy anymore. At this point, I might as well pull an all-nighter fighting back. Calm down. Nice hustle, image manager. Calm down. All-nighters can mess you up, man. Huh? What? You worried about my health? Oh, thanks. I'm even more motivated. Damn it! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna work my butt off. Just watch me. All right. Well, duty calls. I better set out for the battle of the fan site. Time for a wild night of modding and batting. Oh my god. Mishima. <sighs> evening. Sorry, the evening. Hey! Your midterms are coming up! Are they? Better make sure you study. What about that di diner in Shibuya that Mishima told you about? Could be a good place for studying, right? You have permission to go out at night, so no time like the present. I actually right. think I have plans. That reminds me, the home shopping program is airing today. You want to check out the TV? Is there anything still available? Because, geez. Hi, everyone. It's time to do some shopping. Here's what we got for you today. All right. There we go. Relaxation set. Everything you need for when you're not feeling the best. Includes one recovery oil. Three relax gel and three alert capsule. Are you seeing this? What a great deal. But that's not all. There's more. Next up, we have the bionutrient set. Great for anyone who has a green thumb or a love for plants. With one mega fertilizer and five gar garden and energy. These will both be in one set. What a steal. Oh, wow. They're both such great items, I can't decide which one to get. Alright, this is a limited item. Today's the one and only day it'll be available. Even though it should have been done by the day, but okay. And of course, the price is just right. You won't see this kind of deal ever again. Oh, the phones are already ringing off the hook. 
Only a few remaining. Now's your final chance to buy, buy, buy. Hey, hey. Ah, pay the phones are ringing and stop. If we buy one, then the other one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We get it. We're going for the bio-nutrients. I don't even have to think it. That's the one I'm going for. Our buyer just called in. Oh, another buyer just called in. Thank you very much. Oh, they've both sold out. That last customer was extraordinarily lucky. Well, try to get your order. We'll try to get your order to you as quickly as possible. Goodbye for now. We'll see you again next time with another fabulous product. Goodbye for now. Well then. Now all we have to do is wait for it to arrive. Yeah, I know. Anyway, um, we're going to Shibuya, um, underground walkway, because the smoothie shop should have something new. Today's Sunday. Our choose on Sunday, we have Aojiru. Nasty Aojiru. Oh, boy. Well, anything to boost my guts. Mm, that's quite a color. I would not want to drink that. Yes, I know. Nice chugging. That's how you do it. Yeah. Nice. Good job. I was watching you try so hard. Oh, thank you, Morgana. Oh, my God. All right. Mm -mm. All right. Okay, now that you're healthy, let's go somewhere else. All right, um, let's go to the, uh... Central Street now. I could, uh, where is it? Big Bang Burger, was it? Uh, no, it's a beef bowl shop. That's where I worked. Maybe in some professional should work at a beef bowl place, right? Let's go to work. What did you say? Hey, look! There's a ton of customers coming in all of a sudden. Oh boy. You're going to be bombarded with orders at this rate. Make sure you memorize them all. all right. Can I have a medium barbecue bowl? Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh. I'm cheating. I'm cheating. I'm cheating. Uh. Medium barbecue bowl. All right. <laughs> I'm cheating. I'll admit. A curry bowl. Make it large. Large curry bowl. One medium natto bowl. Okay. Large beef bowl. Oh my god. I would not be able to remember this. Oh boy. Alright, stay calm and remember the orders. What did the first person order? A uh, medium barbecue bowl. <laughs> yes, that's right. What did the second person order? A large curry bowl. Hey! Yeah, they did say that. What about the third customer? A medium natto bowl. Nice. Yep, that's what I heard too. And the first, the fourth customer order? The large beef bowl. Here it is. Well. Yep, you're right. That was the order. All right. Now you just have to make everything and serve them. I would have not remembered this, I think. You. You appear to have a difficult time there. Oh, hi. You're the man in the suit from the train station. Can't you ask your manager to hire more people? You are extremely busy. Employees being overworked is becoming a real problem this in the workplace. That's concerning. Mm. Yeah, I should remember this. Well then, I'll see you. I'll again. leave my payment here. Thank you for the food. Hey, hey! Wasn't that the politician who gave speeches in front of the station? He was worried about employees in the workplace, huh? Well, I think he knows who you are now. We should go to the station square again sometime soon. Can we go now? My. Whoa, good work. It seems there were a lot of customers today, but you handled it well on your own. We're we're crowned today as we usually get We're crowded today as we usually get on Yakinuki Day. I wonder if there was some event happening nearby. 
thanks in advance. I paid you a little extra today. Good work. Keep it up. Ooh, 8,800. Nice. So we almost got back all the yen we spent. You were amazing today, dealing with so many orders. I'm sure it was rough, but I think you handled it all quite proficiently. Ooh, three? Perfect! <gasps> yes, rank up! That's what I wanted. All right. Your proficiency has increased from bumbling to decent. Uh, well, I guess we should go home soon. Are we just gonna go home and end the day? Yep, guess that's the end of the day. On to May 9th. What? Well, what's with the goggles? You going snowboarding or something? I hear the setters blooming later than usual. Climate change and what have you. <laughs> Pollen allergies suck. I couldn't go to the mountains even if I wanted to. My eyes and nose would gush like rivers. Oh, I feel that. That sounds awful. Seems pretty rough. That's right. The news said pollen season was starting later than usual this year. Looks like pollen problems have only just begun. People are about to have some itchy eyes. <clears throat> this effect this might affect mementos the same way weather does. What? Really? Huh. Interesting. Morning. Hey, on. Uh, What's wrong? Uh, on. What's up? Actually, I've been having this feeling that someone's watching me. Ah. Uh, uh oh. Stalker. No, it can't be. Oh, maybe I just can't shake off the feeling of infiltrating a palace. Mm -hmm. At the palace, we're always cautious of not being noticed. You know. Mm -hmm. So it has to be my imagination. Yeah. I hope so. I'll beat up anyone who's stalking you. you. Just let me know, girl. Let me know. You can just be like, Meet your sick him! And I'm like, Arr! Okay, I'm stop. <laughs> hey, don't you think the atmosphere at school is kind of different now? Well, yeah, Kamoshida, like, is in jail, but or is in, you know, custody. So, yeah. <laughs> You mean with there being no Kamashita? Yeah, nobody ever talked about him in the open like this before. Yeah, that's true. I wish someone would just thank us for it or something. Either way, everything has worked out for the best. After all, Kamashita's actually been punished for his crimes. Yeah, fuck that guy. That's victory enough for me. I agree. I wonder what's gonna happen to him now. Who cares? Let the authorities handle him. I mean, he's fa he's a famous criminal at this point, right? He's gonna have to deal with people hating him forever. Good, serves him right for being a scumbag. That might be true, but I don't have any sympathy for him. Agree. He got what he deserved. Let it know. Let me know, Anne. For sure. All right. <laughs> Pollen warning. Ooh, it even tells me. After school already? Jeez. Who's messaging? Hey, I have new info for you. But I, I saw it on the fan site, but I heard about it at school too. Anyway, there's a guy at school whose bullying has gone too far. And to help the victim, but that's impossible for me. But I bet the fan and thieves could do something about it. I mean, you already changed the heart of a stalker, so this should be a breeze, right? Uh... Oh, I don't know. Oh. Mm. I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure. Can I just not answer? Piece of cake. You're amazing. The bully is a brown-haired guy frequently standing out in front of the school entrance. And for what I can tell, his name is Daisuke Takanashi. I know you can handle this. Oh. Well, you got some info on a new target. I know there's a small case, but we have a name, so we should be able to consider him a target. 
Quest received. The bark and bite of a bully. Okay. Yep. We got some information. Let's head to the hideout. No, I don't want to go to the hideout. If we're all here, you want to go to Mementos, right? What are you talking about? Don't we need to study for exams? Let's go. Uh, don't worry about that stuff. Let's ignore details and go charge it in head first. Um, That's easy for you to say, but we don't even have a target. Let's go. That's actually not a problem anymore. Some intel has come in from Mishima. All right. No, oh, perfect timing. Just go in right now, then. Uh, you really do anything to avoid studying, huh? Check your information on target by selecting view requests at the hideout or by pressing triangle to view requests in the main menu. Once the information has been confirmed, you can begin by selecting Explore Mementos. Mm. Uh. Mm. Mementos can be explored even without a target, but the time will pass as it would a palace in Fertrasia. Ooh. Looks like caution near her time limit. Oh no. Uh I don't want to. Let's go study at home. Yeah, I don't want to. Oh my god, the pollen's just falling! Ugh. Um, oh, I have a message. Oh! It's Kemi. Hey, girl. I've been busy with all these new patients ever since that girl and her father came in. And this is all your fault. So, you better take responsibility and help me out. Got it? The thing is ready for you, so... Okay, we can become closer. You're right, we'll grow stronger. So, what are you gonna do? You wanna hang out with Takemi? Let's head over immediately. Yes, ma'am. I'm. Yes. Uh, I'll be waiting at the clinic as usual. Yes, mommy. I mean, ma'am. Uh, Takemi. Oh, that old lady from earlier forgot something. Hmm. I wonder if she's still outside. Ma'am. Oh, there she is. Oh, thank you, dear. This is my favorite handkerchief. Uh-huh. It was right in front of me, so... Oh, my. You're a shy one, aren't you? Uh. No, I'm not shy. Yes, you are. My neighbor speaks highly of you. She says your medicines are better than those at the big hospitals. It's very reassuring to have a distinguished doctor right here in town. I'll see you again soon. What the heck? Someone's popular. You seem annoyed. Did something happen? Well, someone's popular. <laughs> Thanks to you. Hmm? <sighs> There's a lot of talk going around town about me, started by that little girl and her dad. Apparently they've been telling everyone that I can make all these amazing medicines and remedies. So now the number of patients I'm seeing has increased dramatically. I don't know what some of these people are thinking, though. I've had a lot of crazy requests. Like yesterday, a patient requested a sweet-smelling compress. And the other day, I had a request for a cold buster. <laughs> a drug like that deserves a noble prize. Other requests have been included hair and skin tonics. I had to go to a consultation about a cat. <laughs> It's not like I'm some kind of genius doctor. I mean, you are a genius. Stop that. No. This is all interfering with my development. I'm only interested in completing my new drug. That's my role as a plague. I'm not suited for all this other stuff. You're a masochist. It suits you. You're not honest. It suits you. What? What? Really? Well, you're entitled to your opinion. Thank you. But a town doctor, huh? A sort of lifestyle profession. Might have been possible for me at one time, but now... Oh yeah, about those clinical trials? With so many pati new patients, it's taking longer to analyze the data, so I'll need to catch up. This is a bit on the stronger side, but I'm sure you'll be okay. Oh my god. Growing deeper. 
Rank up. Do I get anything? No. All right. All right. More XP. Oh. It looks like that girl is going to make a full recovery. The treatment seems to be a good match for her. So at least now I can breathe a little easier for now. Hopefully she'll be able to attend school soon. Thank you. That's good. Good job, Takemi. What? What? What are you so happy about? Are you excited for your next clinical trial? Well then, let's have some fun, my little guinea pig. Uh, mommy. I mean, <clears throat> like cooperating with that shady clinical trial has increased my guts. Just one point, but don't help me. Bye. Okay, thanks for your hard work. Thank you. Oh, there's the message. How's my little guinea pig doing after the catching up drug? The catch up drug? Um, I know it was probably a lot to handle, considering I doubled the dosage and half the activation time. Ugh. But we're so close. We're right at the end of this. I can feel it. I'll need you to stick around just a little bit longer. I hope you can handle it. You can count on me. I think I'm at my limit. Anything for you, mommy. You can count on me. Well, aren't you a little go-getter? If you're that excited about it, maybe I'll just give you a dose of everything and see how you hold up. Uh. Well, I've got some catching up to do. I have to process today's data as quickly as possible. Make sure you call if you ever feel sick, okay? Take care. Alright. There's also something I want to do. Ah, you're back. Hey! Come to think of it. That guy approached you in the beef bowl. Shop was a politician, right? He apparently gives speeches at Shibuya Station, but you can judge a, good, a book by its cover. Yo. Another box came for you. Ooh, thank you. What do you get? All the fertilizers. Oh. Yep, it's just what I ordered. Anyway, oh my god, what is this? Are you no exams are such downer. Let's see. I'm already bummed about tests coming up. I'm in trouble for anything that's not English. I haven't been studying at all. Oh, maybe we can make some progress if we keep an eye on each other. Wanna study together? So, what's it gonna be? Are you going to study with Lady On? Uh, um I'll just. Uh, I'm sorry, on. Uh, I'm going to. Uh, I'm, I'm declining. Uh, <laughs> I actually want to see what the orator has to say. Oh, he's here. Perfect. If he wasn't here, I would have spent time with him. There have been too many incidents recently to ignore. Can anyone deny this? A runaway train incident, Mr. Okay, we already. We have to discover the truth at all. But it per permeates direct negligent government and media. You. You're listening quite attentively. Are you interested in politics? I'm interested. Are you a student? I'm delighted to captivate the interest of someone your age. Hmm? Hmm. Have I seen you somewhere before? Oh, you were working at the Beef Bowl before. You have a lot of perseverance for a young person. If you'd like. Well, if you're interested, I could use your help. I want to change the state of this country, and to do so, I need the power of the youth. However, due to certain regulations, I can't offer a job to a student. I was thinking you could learn some things if you chose to attend a few of my speeches, though. I'd be glad to. Really, that would be very helpful indeed. Well then, would you mind just telling me your name and contact information? Yeah, sure, here you go. Your student from Shujin Academy. Hmm. It's nice to meet you. I'm Toronosuke Yoshida. I used to be a member of the Diet, but no longer. In the past 20 years, I've lost seven straight elections. Oh, wow. This isn't good. I'm dwelling on the negative right before my speech. Very well. Well then. <clears throat> I hope I can count on your help immediately. Immediately? Right now? Oh. Oh, we just get thrown into it. Everyone. The lines of what is considered right and wrong in society today have been blurred. 
With common sense, no longer our guide, we make decisions based on our selfish wants and desires. This has resulted in a deluge of self-centered people who delight in taking advantage of the weak. However, even this, in this modern day and age, it is imperative that we act in the best interest of all. A world where it is acceptable to trample on the rights of others for our own beliefs? A world where the young exist to be exploited? Is a world that must be changed! Huh. Easy for him to say. Old-timers like me have our hands full taking care of ourselves. He's actually making some good points, but he's a no-name. He probably won't get too far. Oh, that's fucked up. Nothing's going to change. We'll just keep getting exploited. What's this wannabe politician blabbering about? He isn't even affiliated with a party. How about you just leave matters to the state of the capable hands of the Liberal Co-Prosperity Party? You mustn't base your decision on whom to support merely according to the party they belong to. I agree! Ah, oh, shut up already! You're just a wash up politician! Uh, if I am chosen to represent the will of the people, then I am fully prepared to... In the best interest of all. Ha! Save the blathering for when you get elected. If you get elected. No, that was rude. Thank you. That is all for today. Well, what did you think of my speech? Best friends of all. Well, the heckling. Hmm? Oh, don't worry about that. Such as I am. I like to believe that I'm capable of giving a moving speech. However, there are times like today when the audience has a difference of opinion on a topic. Some feel like I should concentrate on getting elected before I worry about others. Do you agree? You have my support. Yes, I agree with that. We won't get elected. You have my support, man. Thank you. Thank you. It's encouraging to know that my message has won you over. Besides, I've grown quite accustomed to those types of reaction. Hmm. No. Although, I don't know if that is necessarily a good thing. Regardless, no matter what they say, I must continue on. I think I can learn a lot by listening to Yoshida's speeches. Well then, I shall. Perhaps see you I'll again ask soon. you for your impression again sometime. Oh, we didn't. But he's a confidant, right? It appeared as one when I used my, uh, vision thingy on him. It looks like you're attending school seriously. <sighs> what do you want, Makoto? You also seem pretty close with Takamaki-san if you're both coming to school together. By the way, over there, under the warning, right where the N is, is that the red-haired girl? Like, that we saved on the train and, uh, Kamoshida said all that BS to? Because I think that is. Hey, girl, I'm over here. Please save me. Save me from Makoto, please. You just transferred here, though. I guess you two really click. What's it to you? We're in the same class. Why wouldn't we? I see. You seemed a lot closer than that yesterday morning. Oh, so you're stalking I now? She was a victim of Mr. Kamoshida. But was that all there was to it? Why are you prying so Either much? Way, closer inspection should clear everything up. Goodbye. Goodbye, Makoto. Jesus Christ. Ahem. Exams start tomorrow. Are y'all ready? Well, shall now we then, begin? picking up from last time. Oh God. The end of the high end. Hian period marks the rise of the samurai, which I'm sure you've all been waiting for. Okay. As described, the tale of the Heike. Heike. I'm very bad at pronouncing these older names. It's, I don't know much about Japanese history, so. It was a time when all the great would fall from grace. It wasn't unusual for the heroes of yesterday to be struck down as rebels of the present day. By the way, sympathizing with the loser of the week is called Magistrate's Patronage. The term came from Minamoto no Yoshitsune's position. And it also became a way of referring to him as well. Alright, Miyake-kun. Oh my 
God, why me? Call someone else! Uh... Do you know the answer? You know the time period Yoshisune was active in, don't you? I mean, didn't we just mention it? The Haiyan period, right? Yeah, the Haiyan period. This is it. Correct. That's right. We just mentioned it. That wasn't hard. He supported his brother, Yorimo Yoritomo, during the Haiyan period. But despite his contributions in, de in defeating the Taira, he was driven out by his brother and ultimately executed. Well, However, in the centuries that followed, Yoshitsune became more popular as a tragic hero. Wow, really? Miyake-kun seems kind of smart, doesn't he? Nice going. Wow, you must really be smart to be able to answer a question like that. Not really, Morgana, but thank you. Alright, knowledge. Rather than siding with one who has overwhelming power, people prefer the underdog opposing them. It's sort of like rooting for a minor league baseball team instead of the all-star major league one. Yep. I can understand that. It's like, if I don't root for them, then who will? Yeah, I agree. <clears throat> mm -mm 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 -mm. What are your thoughts? If you're confident in your exams, you can always live in the day up and head to Mementos. It'd be nice if we could get some info on the target before we went, though. I already have hey. info on the target. Hey, shouldn't you tell the others about the target in Mementos? We did. I have a message. Can we chat in Ryuji? Well, I'm focusing on Ryuji now. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I... Uh... <laughs> All right, uh, let's talk with Vaughn. I mean, uh, Ryuji. So we're focusing on Ryuji. What you doing right now? I'm still hanging out in the hallway. Let me know if something comes up. Seems Ryuji hasn't gone home yet. Wanna hang out with him for a bit? Yeah, let's go. I'm heading your way. Got it. Hey, Ryuji. Yo. Yeah, meet you. Heading home. Dude, I really want to talk, or I guess more like vent. Wanna grab some ramen? I'll show you my go-to place. Sure. Hey, closer. And all oh, right, we can level, or rank up. So, what are you planning on doing? Wanna hang out with Ryuji? Hell yeah, let's go. It's kind of far, but it's totally worth. Flavor's out of this world. Wanna get going? Anyways, it's in oh. Okay, Kubo. So, let's take the train over there. Does that unlock a new location? Yes, it does! Hey! Quite convenient residential district fair service ramen. Lip smacking good ramen. Deep flavor of old style soy broth is worth a long time, long wait. All right. Now information on the new hangout spot. Okay, Kubo ramen. You can also invite people who may enjoy eating ramen to hang out with you there. Okay. There are a number of hangout spots in the city, such as shops, event venues, landmarks, and so on. Confidants will each have their own favorite hangout spot. If you go there with them, your bond will grow even deeper than it normally would. Oh, okay. You can learn about hangout spot by having confidants invite you there, or by reading about them in books. Try, found, try to find as many as you can. Okay. Perfect. It is cool, honestly. <laughs> I love the feeling of noodles sliding down my throat, sweat dripping over my face. That sounds so wrong, but it's so right. She's the best, man. Ramen is life. Ryuji, you might want to... Um... Um... Never mind. All the power to you, my man. All the power. What do you mean? Just all the power, my man. Light soup like this really gets your body going again after a good run, you know? We used to come all the way out here after practice and... Uh, I guess that's all in the past. <sighs> By the way, I've seen Nakaoka around a few times. But for some reason, it doesn't look like he's getting along with the others. Nakaoka, are you worried about him? Just let him be. Are you worried about him, my man? 
Yeah, kinda. <sighs> I've been thinking about what he said. The whole track team was putting up with Kamoshida's shit. Oh, he effed up it all for all of them. I think he was right. I don't even go to got a club room anymore. So they've been going all they've been storing all their stuff behind the gym. Can't use any school gear either. They just run laps around the block for practice. That's messed up. There ain't a, really a place for outcasts like that. Can't, now that Kamoshida's gone, like, can't you guys, like, reinstate the track team? Uh, I should know that better than anyone. It's good they're keeping their heads low now, though. I don't want them ending like me. You're doing great. It's not so bad. I know how you feel. Oh, yeah. We're both outcasts here, huh? It's probably tough just walking around school for you with all them rumors and shit. <laughs> really don't belong anywhere, but, you know, maybe that ain't so bad after all. I guess now that I'm thinking about it, trying to fit in is great. Trying to fit in is a real pain in the ass. It is. I mean, I never met you guys if it wasn't if I wasn't an outcast, right? So, uh, it's all good. Hmm? <laughs> For real, though, it's been some, a shit ton of fun hanging out with you guys. So freaking cool. <laughs> Thanks, Ryuji. Right. Rank up. Stealth dash. Ooh. Takemi, I have her rank six. Makes you less likely to be found in the metaverse while dashing. Oh, perfect. That's actually really good. Would you taught you how to stealth dash. Hmm. I just hope there's something I can do to help those guys, those track guys. I'll probably mess them up if I try to butt in. Oh yeah, we still gotta find a new spot for our training. Hmm. I'll think about it. No slacking off till then, okay? All right. See ya. Later, dude. And then I'm gonna get the. The call, right? Uh, Tokyo Tourist. Back. Hey! I wonder if that Yoshida guy is giving a speech in Shibuya again today. Oh, this is on, right? Exams soon. Exams are coming up soon. You're not getting the jump on studying without me, right? Right? If you're gonna do it, we we'll do it together. I'm in serious trouble. No. I'll decide later. I feel so bad for turning them all down. Oh, crossword puzzle! Hey, hey! Are you gonna play crossword puzzles? You have other stuff to do, so don't get too into it. I won't, I won't. Let's play a little. Just a little bit. What are the May Blues? Um. Doom's partner. Don't fucking know Doom's partner. Plant disease. Dull pain. The May Blues. Uh, I'm going on a whim. Right? Oh, I don't have an. Oh, yeah, I do have an E. Oh my god! In Japan, the May Blues are named as such due to the change in seasons and the number of people who fall ill after a long holiday at the April's end. Yeah, usual terms are used across the world. Students in the USA get the September Blues after summer vacations. The UK has the January Blues to contend with. All right. Yeah! Oh, wow! Even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. Maybe you got a bit smarter about solving these crossword puzzles. Yep. That's a little bit of knowledge. Right, and we're gonna go to, um, Shibuya, but we're gonna end the episode here. I'll can I save here? Yeah, I can save here. I'm gonna end the episode here with Coffee Dad. 
because in the next episode we're gonna go to Shibuya station again talk to Yoshida and see if I did something wrong because I didn't get him as a confidant and I saw by okay. using this that he's a confidant see just like Sojiro so yeah we're gonna do that in the next episode and see what else is in store for us so if you guys are enjoying these videos as much as I am, please leave a like, comment, and share. That always helps out against that pesky YouTube algorithm. Subscribe to join the Moonlight Army today. Hit that bell icon to be notified when I upload a new video. If you guys want to stalk me on my social medias, the links will be in the description box below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So, take care, guys. Bye-bye.